what's up guys um summertime you guys is officially coming to an end we only have like what a few weeks we're only in the beginning of uh september but september is the start of fall y'all so i thought it was a good idea to um tell you guys about my favorite scents from bath and body works um the spring and summer collection uh so yeah these are not going to be in any particular order i should have turned my freaking fan off probably i don't know but yeah these are not going to be in any order um, I might go from, yeah, I'm going to go from spring to summertime. And so, yeah, let's get started. Um, the first scent I'm going to talk about, you guys, is the strawberry pound cake that came out this, um, spring. I got this one on my birthday, um, in February, but the spring collection started to come out in February, I think. Um, to be honest, I wasn't really that into Bath and Body Works that much. Like, I would still go every, like, every year on my birthday. But, like, I didn't know, like, when the spring collection came out, summer collection. I didn't really care. I just, when, whenever there was a, a fun-looking scent, I would get it. Um, but, yeah, the strawberry pound cake is so good, y'all. Um, the notes for this are fresh strawberries, golden shirt cake, and whip, whipped cream. Oh, yeah, whipped cream. Um, it smells so good, y'all. Like, to really describe the smell, it smells like there's a freaking strawberry... I'm gonna say yeah, I'm gonna say a strawberry shortcake because I don't know if they meant for this to be like a strawberry shortcake, maybe not, but it smells like there's a strawberry shortcake right here in front of me. Like this this smells good enough to eat. And the cream, y'all, it's starting to change colors, I guess, from aging. But oh my gosh, it smells so good. Bath and Body Works did a really good job with this scent, y'all like how do they do that like how do they get like you know what i mean like how do you make something smell like fresh strawberries without a real strawberry are they using the real thing how do you make it smell like golden shortcake or whipped cream somebody explain to me i might make my own business if they tell me their secrets i like, know nah. who knows it's like <laughs> but yeah i really love this one and it just reminds me of my birthday i actually used this one yesterday so I'm still using it and it's about to be fall time. But anyways, we're going to get into the next scent, which is I believe these um this scent was like in a be in like the middle of spring and summertime and it's the coconut pineapple. I'm pretty sure this is like part of their uh spring collection though, I think. I don't know. I think it is. Okay, the notes, oh, this smells so good. The notes for this is coconut pineapple. There's no notes anywhere written on here, but I'm pretty sure it's just coconut pineapple. Um, it smells just like coconuts and pineapples. Mostly pineapple. That's why I really like it so much. Yes. This one is really good. I feel like you could drink this. Mmm. <laughs> I don't want to spray it now because I feel like I'm going to end up spraying all of them. Am I like halfway done with this pretty much I did not get backups I never get backups because I like to try different things and like see if I like something more or whatever um they might bring it back I'm not even sure um but the next one I believe is also a spring collection it is the Bora Bora y'all these this one, it smells so good. Like, it reminds me of, like, juice. Like, a blue juice. Blue drink, actually. Um, the notes for this are sugar, lemon, dewy water fruit, and vanilla bean. Oh, it has a little... Did this one have a... Probably, but I'm just going to read the little description thing that they have here. I'm dropping stuff. I'm going to read the little description that they have here. And it says, shimmering ocean waves, the scent of crisp crisp sunny citrus in the air bora bora your tropical oasis is calling and this one it smells so yummy like i really hope they bring this one back and look at the packaging this just says like summertime even though i think it came out for the fall but whatever um <laughs> the mess too is so good i use a lot of this this was actually my scent of today <laughs> Did I say that already? Um, <laughs> it's the beginning of September, and I'm still using this. It's about to be fall time, and I'm still using this, y'all. It just smells that good. Um, 
I forgot to mention these scents. I'm doing my favorite scents from the spring and summer collection. This is only from my personal collection. Um, I don't have every single scent. So if you don't see something in here and you're probably like, oh, but this one smells good. I probably don't have it. Because um, <laughs> if I did, I would have added it to my collection because they do have a lot more. They do have a lot more um, other scents that smell really good. I just never got a chance to get them. Um, the next scent is <clears throat> definitely from the summer collection. It is the Raspberry Tangerine. Looks like this. It's so good, y'all. I love this one. Um, I just recently got this one. I got this one during SAS, I believe. Um, the notes for this are Wild Raspberries, Fresh Tangerine, and Lemon Zest. I didn't even realize there was Lemon Zest in here. Oh, y'all. Now, this one, this is candy. Candy-like to me. It's so good. Perfect for summertime. Like, you want to smell like some juicy candy? Who that? You want to smell like some juicy candy? Mm. Not again. Yeah, but it smells so good, y'all. Definitely one of my favorite, favorite, favorites of all time, probably. Actually, all of these are, like, probably my favorite favorites of all time. I, um, I really wanted to get the mist for this. Maybe it'll come back for, um, next SAS, like, after Christmas time or during Christmas time. Because I would really like to get the mist for this. It is so good. I really missed out on the mist, but we're just hoping that it'll come back, you know, so I can get the full collection. I never really get, um body cream and the body lotion but I got the body cream I got the body cream as a gift so I'm so happy I have that in my collection now wow cat fur there's cat fur down there um okay you guys and this one the next one I'm going to talk about you guys is so freaking good y'all y'all can probably already guess what it is you want to guess Okay, it is the Boardwalk Taffy. Y'all, okay, let me tell you something. When I first um, got this, I ordered this one online. And when I got it, I'm like, I was like, um, it smells okay, but it wasn't like what I thought it would be. But the more I used it, y'all, this is like one of my favorite scents of all time from Bath & Body Works. Yes, it smells so good. Okay, let me read you the notes. Um, spun sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. Yes. <sighs> this should have been my scent of the day, but I'm going to probably stick with the Bora Bora today. <sighs> okay, I have to spray it, though. I have to. Let me just spray. Ugh, it just smells so good. And the cream, y'all. This is one of those scents that I would actually get backups for. <laughs> Even though I just said I don't really get backups, but this is that good. This is so good. And um, I forgot to tell y'all, I ordered the Pink Velvet Cupcake, so that should be coming soon. And I'm going to do a review on that. Um, yeah. So, <laughs> this one, it smells so good. Oh, I didn't read the, the description. Summer days spent strolling the boardwalk with the smell of saltwater taffy in the air I just need to get one more whiff one more whiff before I go on <sighs> to me it smells like fruit loops y'all or um lucky charms that's what this really smells like to me and like um I can smell um I guess the berries that might be like the cereal type of note that I'm getting and the sponge sugar mixed together is like cereal to me yeah that smells so good. Am I like, how much it is that? I got like, I have a little bit more than half of this. So I'm, I'm good on this one. I don't really need to uh, worry too much. Um, maybe they'll come back for SAS too. <laughs> maybe all of these will come back for SAS. <laughs> um, yeah, but that one is so good. I just love the pink on this, y'all. All these packagings, y'all, it's just so good. Um, okay, now. These next two scents that I'm going to show you guys, they didn't necessarily come out this um, year, this spring and summer. But 
is some scents that I have been using during the spring and summer. <laughs> and it is, of course, the French lavender and honey. Y'all know how I feel about this. Hold on, let me read the notes first. What is this? Dirt? It must have fell on the ground. Um, okay, the key notes for this are French lavender, lily of the valley, nectarine de province, sun-kissed honey, and white oak musk. I don't really smell musk in this. To me, it's just like a, a light floral scent, like light sweet floral scent and it's just so good I just sprayed that didn't I and I wasn't supposed to it's like really sweet and that's what I like about this even though it is a floral but it's just so nice and it's so sweet and it actually I can wear this throughout the year and I'm not even scared I mean why would I be scared but it goes perfect for any season to be honest like I'm gonna keep using I didn't have to do that but I'm gonna keep using this fall time winter back into spring summer it's a cycle I'm gonna keep using it y'all I'm gonna keep using this one okay um and the last scent you guys um the packaging came out this year so does it count um it is the black cherry merlot and this is from the um, mother's day um Mother's Day packaging? Yeah. Um, I really like this one too. Um, the notes for this is dark cherry, black raspberry, and sumptuous. Is that it? Yeah, sumptuous Merlot. Um, yes. <sighs> like to me, I'm going to spray it. To me, it just smells like like black cherries um i don't know what merlot smells like and i kind of it's a wine right um yeah i'm not really too i don't know much about that but i kind of i just smell black cherries but the more i smell it i am getting like a a wine scent because i do know what wine smells like what's that i do know what wine smells like but well kind of whenever um like a fruit goes bad I just hear someone say it smells like wine so I'm guessing fermented fruit is wine fermented um, grapes um, <laughs> I'm getting a hint of that now actually but it's not too heavy for me I guess because I'm too focused on the black cherry part and it's just so good um, I know in one of my videos I said I wouldn't be using this until like fall time but I've been using it and I probably will continue to use it during fall um, but yeah, I really do like this packaging. They came out with another, um, packaging for fall. And, um, I think that one looks pretty cool, too. It's, like, marbly gold and red. It's so nice. Um, but yeah, you guys, that's all of the scents that I've been using this year for spring and summer 2020. Um, let me know what your, what your guys' favorite, um, scents was this year from the, you know, hotter seasons. <laughs> I, keep, I feel like I keep saying spring and summer 2020. Oh, well. What were your guys' favorite scents from this year so far? Let me know in the comments, y'all. That would be nice. I like to read the comments a lot. Um, but anyways, you guys, I think this is going to be the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, like I said, please. Um, <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye. Hee.